How to automatically add serial number if a cell has value. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel Train Tutorial. In this intermediate Excel tutorial, I'm going to explain how you can add automatic serial number in Microsoft Excel if you have a value in another cell. And also, the serial number will be sequential and if you have any blank rows in between, it will not count those blank rows. So, let's get started. <laughs> Take a look at this workbook here. I have serial number in column A, column B I have names and then profession and then country and I want to add serial number automatically here and I want to leave this blank rows as it is and the serial number should be sequential. So what I want here the first cell this should be serial number 1 and then this one this should be serial number 2. This one is 3 and then this one is 4. And I want to keep this to blank row as it is. Okay. I'm going to use formula to solve this. And I have already explained different approach to add serial number in Excel. You can check them here. So without further ado, let's write the formula here. So I'm going to write equal to and then write if now within parentheses, I'm going to select the cell B2. Okay. Now, if B2 is not empty, that is my condition. So, I'm going to add this sign and then I'm going to add double quotation. So, this will indicate if the cell B2 is not empty. Now, this is my condition. So, what will be the value if it's true? So, the value will be, I'm going to use the count A function. So, count A and then I'm going to count from cell B2 to the rest of the column. Okay. So I'm going to fix cell B2 with dollar sign. So add dollar and then B, then add dollar sign again and then 2. Okay. Now I'm going to add a colon and I'm going to write B2. Okay. Close parenthesis. So if this part is true, then the counter function will count from the first cell to the cell number which is referenced here. So I didn't fix the second cell reference because when I drag this formula, it will automatically increase by one. Okay. Now I'm going to add another comma. So if the condition doesn't match, what we want here is to leave it empty. So we are going to add another double quotation and then close parenthesis and then press enter. So we have our first serial number, which is one. Now, if I drag the formula, let's say I want to drag it to here. And you can see we have our serial number automatically placed. Okay. Now let's add another entry here. Let's write Kazi. And you can see the serial number is automatically added. Let's add John. And we have our serial number added. Now you can see from 37 and then we have a blank row and then we have 38 so it doesn't count the blank rows so what if we remove a blank row here the serial number doesn't change now what if we remove a row with value and you can see the serial number automatically changed and adjusted okay so this is how you can create automatic serial number in Microsoft Excel and it doesn't matter if you have a lot of blank rows in between, it will not count those blank rows. This is what I wanted to show you. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. If you can, support the channel through Patreon and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.